Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many web developers encounter. What's the difference between using type equals hidden and the hidden attribute in HTML forms? Our viewer has noticed two patterns in their web app, and they're curious about how these two approaches differ in functionality and best practices. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully find that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully find that resolution you're looking for. Now, let's continue on to the video. Let's begin by understanding the difference between typey hidden and hidden as an attribute in HTML forms. The input type equals hidden creates a form field that is not visible to users, but can still be submitted with the form data. On the other hand, using the hidden attribute completely removes the element from the accessibility tree, making it invisible to screen readers. In terms of best practices, use type equals hidden for form data that needs to be submitted, while hidden is better for elements that should not be interacted with at all. In summary, while both methods hide elements, they serve different purposes in forms and accessibility. Choose wisely based on your needs. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Let's clarify the difference between typey hidden and hidden as an attribute. When you use input hidden, it's a shortcut for input hidden hidden, which is different from input type hidden. The hidden attribute works like style equals display none, allowing elements to be hidden even if CSS isn't supported. However, elements with hidden can still be submitted in forms. In contrast, inputs with type equals hidden are submitted but can't be modified or viewed by users. This is important for form handling. In summary, use typos hidden for form submissions and hidden equals hidden, or CSS for simply hiding elements. The choice is more about semantics, but type equals hidden has better support in older browsers. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. The main difference between type equals hidden and the hidden attribute is that in some browsers, like Chrome on iOS, the hidden attribute limits the input value to 500 kilobytes. Additionally, the hidden attribute is not fully supported across all browsers. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your questions, and hopefully found that solution that you're looking for. If we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.